All right, so here's the guy that wanted to be the U.S. president. I bet everybody knows. Uh, this is his Facebook page. Today, as you know, is March the 7th. He's got a 58 million followers, but don't worry about that. This is a real, real leader, a real hero. And I'm going to do this stuff just in case, so... Oh, man, what a hero, what a strong guy this is, huh? 58 million, 60 million followers, according to Facebook. Check this out. We're going to start here at January the 26th, look. And that's pretty much what it's all about. Uh, bottles and lifting, basically. That's an intellect of an individual who wanted to become a U.S. president. Actually, he bragged about something running for American presidency in 2020. I'm doing this because I just want to make sure that he's not going to think about doing even something like this in the future. It's the 12th day today of a massacre, onslaught of Ukrainian people, onslaught on Ukraine, Russian onslaught on Ukraine. There's already over close to 2 million Ukrainian people that ran out of Ukraine. How many have been killed so far? It's even difficult to tell. Uh, but the numbers ran really, really high into thousands of people, civilians, soldiers. Just as I stated, other than food and lifting, you're not going to see here. Bottles, alcohol, and that's about it. That's, that's as far as you can get here. And that's a real, real leadership, a competence of someone eventually who wanted to become a U.S. president in 2020. Someone whom initially I have even casted my vote and started to support because I thought, you know, I just thought that this, this man could actually make a difference that much for the difference. Today is this here. This is exactly the time and date. I just want you to see that really, really closely. It's... Uh, 12th day of onslaught on Ukraine and as I stated I did this so some crap like this would not think about really in the future about running for the president in the US or something like this so we won't have a second Obama or even worse actually because it's exactly this kind of leadership next to Donald Trump, next to George Bush, who created this stuff. United States of America and the world need not. Some say one and a half million. It's not really true. It was said earlier today it was already 1.7 million and they anticipate soon it's going to be 5 million. That's what this is all about. I want to make sure about that kind of stuff.